are going to talk about the pyramid of Khufu. Khufu is a king who ruled Egypt 2,650 years. They built for us or for this pyramids about 20 years they spent it for building this pyramid. 20 years to build this is a great pyramid, one great pyramid of Giza. 100,000 workers, 100,000 workers, more than 5 million pieces of, of limestone, which they cut it from Torah Mountain, which almost 25 kilometers from here. Why they bring it from Tura Mountain? Because the Tura Mountain, it is the best place to get the fine limestone in Egypt. By the way, Mohammed, does they use the slaves in building the pyramid? And everybody asked me before about that, ever, never they use the slaves for building the pyramids. Why? Why that? Because if you look over there, we have tomb of the workers. If they are slaves, they will make for them a tombs. We'll find the treasures on it. We find some hieroglyphic papyrus rules telling us about the daily payment of them. And by the way, most of the construction operation happened in the pyramid during the flood time because we have during the ancient time three seasons in the year flood, planting, harvest. During the flood time, okay, most of the planting land covered by water, so that at this time the people don't have a lot of work, so they come work for the kings or for the country and they pay for them at this time. By the way, this is area, as I mentioned for you during the flood time, they used to have water around here, so this is more easy for them to transfer the block of stones from the Torah mountain, from the quarry to here during the flood time, so they float and get. Mohammed, can you prove for us that? Yes, I have all Alpo with me here, a tele a talking to us or show us the view of the pyramid during the ancient time before we build the high dam. You are lucky because all the time I get this old photo album and people take it from me. Can you believe that? Yes. See? It's you see water. the pyramids and you see the people that are selling over here. Nowadays the Nile River is far away from here. It's more than from 6 to 10 kilometers. So all of this is area, the planting area nowadays, which used to be covered by the water during the ancient time. The King Coyops, he built for us this is amazing pyramid, which is the high of it used to be 147 meter square, the high of it. But nowadays it is almost 139 meters. Why? Because the effects of the weather, so we lost some of it. All this pyramid used to be smoothed, covered by plaster or the gypsum, but nowadays it is gone. Okay. The pyramid inside it, when you go inside it, you'll find the corridors and there is two burial chambers inside the pyramid. What is the two burial chambers inside the pyramid? One, it was the burial chamber of the king Khofu and one, it is the burial chamber of his wife. You will find the massive sarcophagus, okay, of the king Khofu or Kaibs. And also, you, when you go there, there is no scene, no inscriptions. There is only one scene inside and the sailing of it. What is the scenes which you are going to see it? It is the cartouche with the name of the king Khofu. Do you know what's mean cartouche? Uh, is, is, um... That is the cartouche, my dear friends. Cartouche is the oldest... Um... Yes, that is the symbol where they used to write the name of the king and it's referred to the eternity. It is referred to the eternity. This is what we call it cartouche. When we go to all the kings or, or tombs or the pyramids or, or sorry the temples, you'll find all the kings they have two names. One it was the first name and one it was the coronation name. And both of them they are written in the cartouche. So there is nothing here inside this pyramid from things except his cartouche. You'll find it in the ceiling of the burial chamber. By the way, the most I think, if you make a calculation from the high of the pyramid to the whites. 
give you 3.4 okay if you go inside the beer chamber and you make a calculation from the high of the wall inside the beer chamber in the wides of the wall give you 3.4 uh, sorry 4.3 4, 4.3 yes 4.3 and the distance between the earth and the sun 4.3 million kilometers it may look like a big pyramid, but he built a statue for himself, five centimeters big.